One of the most common questions I get as a consultant focused on the geospatial industry is what goes into a geospatial strategy. In this video, I'm going to explain the basics of geospatial strategy, including what it is, what it's not, and the key elements of an effective strategy. Welcome to Geospatial Strategy Essentials in 5 Minutes. My name is Matt Lewin and I'm the Director of Management Consulting at Esri Canada. In this series of videos, I go beyond the hype of tools and technology to help you understand what it takes to do spatial at scale. All things I've learned in over a decade focus on geospatial strategy development in the public and private sector. Before I get into it, I want to focus on the two words that make up the term geospatial strategy. The first is geospatial. What is geospatial? Geospatial is a catch-all term for the tools and methods used to acquire, map, and analyze geographic information. This is a very broad term. It can be applied to many different things, from GIS to remote sensing to earth observation, from mapping to geomatics to location intelligence. All of these fall into the bounds of what we refer to as geospatial. The key is all of these in some way refer to geospatial data. That is information about somewhere on planet Earth. The second word is strategy. What is a strategy? This is a term that so many people struggle with. It's a concept that volumes of literature have been written about, going all the way back to the ancient Greeks. But the modern use of strategy in a business context has its roots in the teachings of Harvard Business School professor Michael Porter, who said that strategy is about making choices. Choices that define where and how your business competes and wins. A classic example of this is Toyota. The strategy Toyota developed in the 1980s was to focus on building the most efficient manufacturing process in the world so that they could outcompete other manufacturers on the basis of cost. Every choice that Toyota made in terms of the systems they built, the people they hired, the processes that they implemented were 100% aligned with achieving their goal of being the lowest cost manufacturer in the game. They built a winning strategy by focusing on where they compete and how they'd win. That brings me to the purpose of this video. What is a geospatial strategy? Well, if geospatial refers to the insights derived from geographic information, and strategy refers to the choices you make in pursuit of a goal, then a geospatial strategy is the set of choices that you make in terms of people, process, and technology that define how your organization leverages geographic information to achieve its business goals. We refer to this combination of people, process, and technology as your organization's geospatial capability. You'll notice I didn't focus exclusively on software or data in my definition. That's because we're concerned with building a holistic capability. One that's as much about the culture of spatial thinking and the processes that enable it as the tools and data that we tend to focus on. You'll also notice I didn't use the word plan. That's because a strategy is not a plan. A strategy is implemented by a plan. To bring your geospatial strategy to life, you need a strategic plan that defines the goals and aspirations of your organization, the choices that define your strategy, and the specific steps and deliverables to implement your strategy. Remember, your strategy defines your approach, and there are infinite combinations of people, process, and technology that can define your strategy. Yes, there are always best practices that you can use as a guide, whether it's committing to cloud-first deployment practices, or establishing a shared center of excellence. All of these are good choices in theory, but they're only the right choices in practice if they fit the unique culture and goals of your business. Your job is to figure out the unique mix of people, process, and technology, and build a geospatial capability that makes sense. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Matt from Esri Canada. Stay tuned for more geospatial strategies in five minutes in the future. If you like this content, please hit like or share this video. And if you have suggestions for topics, please put them in the comment box below. For further reading, check out my ebook, Geospatial Strategy Essentials for Managers. The link is on the screen. In the meantime, thanks for watching. See you next time.